Yeah. That's a good one, dude. What's going on, guys? Welcome to another video. Ooh, woo! Did you guys hear that? Thank you guys so much for the support. Today is an amazing day outside. It's currently, it's like 55 degrees, but it still feels great. I do have pants on today, but then again, it feels good outside, guys. We actually had practice canceled today, but I'm gonna be going anyways because I wanna go catch some big fish. Welcome to another episode of Fishing for Giants. Episode two. I think this is what the episode is gonna be if it pans out to be what I think it's gonna be. I want to film this series. I think people had mis misassumptions on what this series actually is. If you guys are wondering what fishing for giants is, is when I go to ponds where there's obviously a lot of big fish. I'm not just gonna go to ponds where I average catching small fish. And I'm gonna go attempt to go catch some giants, of course. Attempt, note that I said attempt. It's gonna be the whole process of me leading up to catching the big bass. It's gonna be a cool series. If you guys wanna see this series, be sure to smash that thumbs up button and comment below. Moving on to what's gonna be going on today is we're going to the landings where there is a lot a lot a lot guys of giant bass very pumped up about it last year we went as a team and when i'm talking a ton of big fish i'm talking a ton of big fish guys um i believe the biggest one is 12 pounds and if i hook one of those today you guys might hear me scream like a little baby because that is a big fish and i hope we're just gonna smash some big ones today but let's go ahead and hop into my car we got about a 35 40 minute drive and head over to the pond all right guys just got to the pond right here we're about to go try to catch some fish out here with these guys introduce walker. yourself walker hey i'm pete we're about to go out here guys we're about to catch them very excited look See that right? yeah we're about to go catch some big fish guys i'm pumped Hopefully it's not gonna be too tough. Like I said, the weather's been messed up. The fish have just been really acting weird, but we're gonna go out here. We're gonna try our best and hopefully catch some monsters. Whip it out there. I'll put this rattle trap around. Whip that thing out there though. It won't back left. Oh God, this rattle trap looks too good. How smooth it is. Look at the alligator in front of that one, dude. Dude, he's about to eat him. Look at that. Look. Look at that. Dude, he is like on that thing. Look at that alligator, guys. That's a decoy. <laughs> I thought he was about to just nail that decoy. Look at him. He's just watching us. Holy crap. He's got a seagull. That's crazy. It's so weird how we're just like a few minutes from where we live and it's like a whole different world in it weird Ooh, dude something hit the crap out of me right there all right guys first pond done with we got nothing i did have a bite did see some alligators we did see some wildlife but nothing yet we're gonna get to the next one see what we can throw together There he is, guys. A little tiny one. A little baby. Wow. This got the skunk off her back, though. I don't care how small they are. It's the first one. <laughs> got the skunk off of us. Come on, fishy, fishy, fishy. Where you at? Where you at, fishy? Caught him right where those rocks were. That jerkbait? You happy now? <laughs> Finally got one on that. Same size, yeah. yeah they all count, man. I wasn't fishing for a 10 pounder, but I'll take it. <laughs> you got him? What, it come up and swat at it? Jeez, dude, that thing is huge. That's why these bass are so big. Wow. That's a good one. Dang. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it looks like. Someone got their fishing line stuck and it tangled up that bird and it actually died. That's crazy. Sad. Oh my God. There we go. He choked it. Ch 
choked it. Look at that, guys. That's called choking. That is called choking. You couldn't have ate it better right there. That's how they're supposed to eat it. That's a pretty fish. The colors on it, you know? Wow. Good deal, guys. Little baby right here, this little rattle trap's getting it done. Got the monkey off her back at this pond. And Isaac caught two crappie and a bass, and I've caught two bass. So that, nothing big, but I'm happy with that. We're hunting for these giants right now. This isn't about the process of just whacking giants every time we go. This is about the process of finding these giants. How are we gonna catch them? We know there's big fish in these ponds. It's just if they're going to bite is the question. I just don't get how one fish can choke it, but you can't get any more bites. I mean, the bites are coming in now. I'm, I'm, I'm satisfied with what we're, what we're getting right now, even though they're not the best size. We're getting bites, and that's what matters. Oh, that's a decent fish. He's just skinny. <laughs> yeah. That's a good one, dude. Oh. <laughs> dude, I thought he was bigger than that. Yeah, look how fat he is. Yeah. All right, guys, beautiful fish right there. That's a very pretty fish, very pretty colors. Let's get a release on her. Right here, yeah. Oh my God, come on. I don't know, something pulled back on it, it felt like. Yep. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah. Two and a half, two and three quarters. Yeah, they are. He didn't choke it, but that's a good one. Yeah. Yeah, might as well. There ain't nothing wrong with those. Here we go, guys. Another pretty fish. Nothing wrong with that size at all. That's perfect. See, this is where they're at. That's right. Yeah, that's where I was waiting on to come around. I knew there was going to be more. Threw back in there and he ate it. All right, here should be decent. So. They're eating this trap pretty good, too. Five? Five now. Five on it. Nothing big. Baby, baby, baby. All right, guys, this is where we're at right now. This pond goes all the way around. How we're catching them is pretty much on the points coming back in here into these little pockets. Same way over there and same way over there. Pretty much catching them on these little points that are leading into here. Um, that's where we're getting all the bites. Caught a big one over there and caught a big one right there. They're not big, but you know, over two and a half pounds. And um, the rest, like I said, just coming back in here. They won't, they're not out shallow back here. Um, none of the bites that we got have really been super shallow. It's just coming into the mouth. Like this is about as far as I'd say they are. All right, guys, we're about to close it up. I broke off the rattle trap in a tree and I'm gonna see if I can go around and get it right here. And then we're gonna be leaving. It's about to get dark right now. So we wanna go ahead and get out of here before it gets too dark. Very, I'd say it was a pretty successful day so far. I mean, it was, it was a good, it was a great time. We didn't do, as good as in size of fish as I was hoping, but we caught them in a whole different area that I've never been to, and we caught a good amount. You know, we caught like ten fish, and I'm very, very blessed with that. I think that's a good, that's a good day. Wow, Isaac just missed one. How big was he? Yeah, fish are still biting. I got you. <laughs> It probably, it looked way closer when I was over there. <clears throat> I mean, I got like two, bro. I got, if I was gonna take it, it's... 
All right, guys, just got in the car. What an awesome day, you know, it was just a beautiful day out on the water. It felt amazing outside. It wasn't cold, it wasn't hot, it was just perfect. And around 50, 50, 55, 56 degrees. The fishing was tough, you know, the fishing was tough at the beginning. And that's the pond that like the big ones are usually at. So that's that's kind of the confusing part. And that's what I plan on making this video is fishing for big giants. You know, that's the main focus on this series, but it's the process to leading to catch those giants. How are we finding them? And how those fish were biting today, you know, we're finding them on those points coming back into the creeks. That's and coming back into these little pockets. I mean, that's all it was, simple as that. Um, and those fish were there. I mean, they were stacked up right there. Couldn't catch them anywhere else. You're catching them pretty shallow. There's just so much grass in this place. It's hard to get your bait, you know, moving perfectly because I was getting so much grass on my lure. But guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, you guys know what to do. Be sure to smash that like button. Comment below and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you guys so much. I love you guys so much. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Please like this video. Please comment below your goals for 2018. I want every single one of you to comment at least one goal. And I want you guys to go execute and achieve that goal. Don't be normal. We're going to change the world, guys. Thank you guys so much for the support. I'll catch you guys in the next video.